are you dead? No, 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 no. Oh! 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 Hey, what is going on, guys? It is Lachlan here, and welcome back to a brand new episode of Stranded Deep. If you guys did happen to miss the last episode, we ended up on this island over here, which we really don't know too much about. There was this ship over here, which when it was nighttime, we couldn't really find anything in it. Are these live crabs? No, these are, yeah, these are live crabs. Excuse me, Mr. Oh, wow, I can pick up live crabs? I didn't know I could do that. What if I was to have a crab on my ship at all times? Like a live crab. Is that? It's not allowed to be done, apparently. Wait, maybe you can't throw the live crabs. No, you definitely can. What if I had chopped it in midair like, like Fruit Ninja? Fruit Ninja with crabs, ready? I'm gonna get this and... Oh, that's a hard game to play. Come on, maybe Fruit Ninja with the crab. It's such a hard game, dude. I wanna try and not throw it up as high. Oh, got him! Where'd he go? Oh, he's in here somewhere. He's in here, but I can't find him. I've killed the crab, and now he's in here. I'm sorry, Mr. Crab, I've let you down. <laughs> hey, yeah, what happens if I put a, a crab upside down? Does that mean he's gonna have, like, a, a hard time getting back up? Like, is he gonna just... Look, he can't get back up. All right, anyway, so let's take the crabs. We're wasting our daylight. We just got this daylight. Let's not waste it. So, uh, food-wise, I think I'm pretty set. I just need a little bit more uh, potatoes. I ate off-screen to try and make it nice and fluid. You guys have asked for it. Longer episodes, we're going to try for it. Um, I apologize if we do wrap it up, kind of. I don't know, it's hard because I do a lot of off-screen um, foraging, building, and stuff like that. So it's kind of a smooth-flowing episode every time. But uh, I'm going to quickly do, like, like, I like to... Forage off screen if you would yeah, I, I guess you could say that I like to forage off screen and find things Yeah, I don't want to just go ahead and co uh, collect the corrugated scraps. We've got too many of them Oh a house. Yes, not a house a boat, but it might be a houseboat. So like it's a house I'm gonna quickly do a little lap around these islands I'm mainly looking for items within boats special items, but I would of course love to get ahead on uh, making my boat something Huge. I would love to try uh, start collecting some sticks on the islands and trying to just upgrade my raft to crazy crazy amounts And just having the whole thing. I mean, I'd love to use barrels, but like they're just really hard to find So it's not as easy as just like yeah, I'll make it out of barrels It's like nah, you gotta you gotta grind for those barrels So let's take our boat all the way over to that place and have some fun with it uh, Anything else that I can see around doesn't seem to be anything else floating rocks floating trees floating yukas and that seems to be oh another stick. I don't want to collect the rocks. I've got way too many rocks Although you guys are suggesting I build a spearfish guys. Don't worry. We will be getting on that very very soon Just want to go space that I definitely want to get like a whole fishing rig set up So I don't have to you know keep killing the crabs and whatnot I can kill their sardines in the water I see sometimes I would also like to start killing sharks. You reckon spears are the best things for sharks um, love to know your input. I, that's what you guys were saying. Also, big thank you to everybody who's supporting the series this far. It's been really awesome. Oh, we're hitting a wave. Woo, we got air on that one. Whoa, we're hitting waves. Oh, I thought that was a shock. I got a little scared. Well, that is a shock. That's a shock. That's a shock. That's a shock. All right, we gotta be careful here. We have a shark. Uh-oh. Is he gonna try and hit me? It's always a heated... Oh, don't dare knock my ship. All right, okay. I wanna... I won't wanna get off my position here. Um... I don't want to fight him. I, I, I never want to fight them, really. They're always good to me, the sharks. Let's get off our sail here. And if, if, if in doubt, we always aim for the sail. All right, what, what do we have in here? I don't think he can get past those. Is that another chest with nothing in it? What the freak is going on with these chests? Oh, you dare knock my ship. I think my ship is too solid. I might be able to get some cheap hits on him on the side here. Yeah, come a little closer. Come a little closer. I don't think you can knock me. My ship's way too solid. For your little glitchy moves that you're trying to do right now. I could get on that little thing over here. I'm scared, like I said, if I get in here. It, I don't think I'll be able to get back out of there. Because I can't. Oh, I have to wait for the tide. Yeah, I would have to wait for the tide. Uh, it's, it's, if, this, if the ship was just a little lower, I would feel a little more secure. Um, come on. Get away from me. I want that flare gun. I don't know if the flare is tracked or... Uh, oh, wait. I know. I'll, I'll, I, I, I give you a crab as tribute. I'm really scared he'll glitch through that and try to get through. I gotta stop being such a bitch with this series, man. I'm really scared, though, with these sharks. I don't think he can get on that. I need to get, like, a texture pack so sharks are just, like, happy little fish or something. And that's not gonna work. They'll st they'll st I might be able to get it. I can't hit. I can't hit from the upside. We've actually been here for, I'm not even kidding, five minutes. We try and get a good sprint jump on the tide to get up onto the roof, maybe. 
Yes, got it. Oh, and well, I guess that works, actually. No, I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take that, indeed. All right, so what are we going to get from this place? We're going to grab ourselves a bandage, just in case the shark rips us to pieces. I rate that highly. Uh, locker, what are we got in here? Uh-oh. A little bit of a... A little bit of a tide glitch there, nothing else. Uh, a flare, a cloth, and what's that? Oh, a whistle. How do we use it? How do we use it? I'm using my whistle. Go away, shark. Go away. I can now whistle at the shark, and he might leave me one day. What else are we dealing with here? What else are we dealing with? We have the console. Please give me an engine. Uh, a propeller and a carburetor. You suck. You used to be cool. So you gave me the same stuff I already had. All right, so the only way I can really get rid of the shark is to whistle blow at him. Where is he? Where is he? I'm whistling at you, girl. Where are you? Did he go away? I think he left us. I think he made it, left us in peace. Oh, thanks, Mr. Shark. You're the best. Wait, where's that? That would be our boy. Um, hello. How are you today? Maybe I can kill him from this side. Come a little closer, Sharky. I am playing with fire right now. But not fire. We're playing with water, really. Oh, okay. I don't think I can hit him unless I'm literally in the water. I'm oh, there. I got a hit on him. Got a hit on him. Yeah, he's not happy about that one. He's pissed off about that. Yeah, you don't like them apples, eh? Oh, he's coming. He's coming. Oh, I can't see the glare of the reflection of the ocean. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? I don't actually know. Oh, I missed him again. Got him. There's two. Oh, I got two hits on him. After a certain while, his AI tells him to piss off if you hit him a lot of times. Um, maybe I hit him enough times. The sun's starting to go down, by the way. So, like... Oh, there's a ladder here. I didn't even know there was a ladder. Why do half the ladders in this game just outright not work? Honestly, as well, I've got enough from what I need from this place. Um, but I would like to try and kill this shark. Even if it takes all night, I will literally... Keep cheap shotting him. This, though, was some bullshit. Like this. Like, what was that about? That was just like, you know, let's just give him nothing for no reason. Yo, I hear him. I hear him. I hear him. Oh, just missed that hit. Coming up less often now, eh? Are you a little scared or something? A little scaredy cat. In all seriousness, though, if you're not going to take the tribute of the crab, I'm going to go back and get him. Because, oh, no, I think the tide took him. I think this is a safe place to be up on. These little mushroom stacks. Sure, they're good, right? Hey, sharky. <laughs> Where you at, Sharky? Sharky! Oh, there you are! Hey, Sharky! Sharky, where you go? Sharky, oh, there you are! Come on, come on, get some! Come on, get some! You know you want some! Come on! Oh, he's going back down, he's going back down! Oh, oh, oh! It's quiet. Too quiet. This guy's giving up, I think. This guy's giving up on uh, trying to kill the locks. I think I, I do want to explore more of this place, though. I for sure do. There's definitely a place... Oh, he's not giving up. I'm very, very tempted to go down there and, and get the loot. Oh, I see him too. There he is. I almost thought he left me alone for a bit. All right, let's get our uh, feet in the water a little bit more and uh, see if he'll uh, want to come back. I said this could take all night, and I don't lie when I say it. It's actually a lot easier to see the shark now during the nighttime. Come on, shark. He only needs a couple more chops, and he's dead anyway. Then we'll see he's the king of the ocean. Wait, what if we whistle for his attention again? Hey, Sharky! Over here! Sharky! Okay, interesting here. We have an emergency flare, and this description of it is that it will save your life or scare away predators. So, hopefully, it will scare away predators. Go away! Nobody likes you! Go away! Oh, this is actually kind of cool. All right. Go away, Sharky. I have a flare here. It's permission that you have to abide by and leave me alone. If you don't, you're breaking the rules of the shark code. This flare's useless. They lied to me on the wiki. They said it would they said it would protect me. Look, there he is again. He's not getting close now. It's like he knows I'll F him up. With all the productivity I could have done, instead I'm still here on the boat being a massive bitch. I could have literally found another boat. But I just... I just want to see. Okay, so it's not on this side of the door. I think the door is directly underneath me. Right there. It's funny. I can literally just, like, go down here. Hey, Sharky. Are you dead? No, 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 no. Oh! 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 no, I can't reach that. Come on. Yes! Got him! Oh, there's two! Oh, there's two sharks! No, I can't deal with two. I can barely deal with one. 
could have bit my feet off. He could have legit bit my feet off. All right, now we're dealing with an issue here. Because Banter Barrels is too far away. I have to... I think I have to man up. I'm very scared to make this jump. I'm also scared that they can, like, you know, try and bite my feet off. All right, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna save this. And if I fail this jump, I'm gonna instantly press escape and quit. Let's get the fudge out of here. Avast ye, mateys! Eat a doodle, sharks! Eat a big fat doodle! We're going to land. And there ain't shite you can do about it. Is that three sharks? One, two. I think there's three sharks here. Yeah, there's a good hit. There's a good hit. I could keep hitting these guys all night. Two hours later, and I'm still here shooting sharks. Got him. Yeah, how do you like them? Them apples? How do you like them? The sun is rising, but sharks, they still come back for more. There's one hit. These things don't learn, do they? Alrighty, I think it's necessary that we move on to bigger things. I've literally spent 27 minutes, like, contemplating whether to fight the shark or not. I don't want to fight him. It's just something I'm very scared of. I, I'm very scared of sharks. That's why I, I don't like the sharks. <laughs> that was a swordfish trying to attack me. I think I'd actually go in and try to kill it because swordfish are a banter. Like, they really are. They really are a banter. Like, when I think of a swordfish, I think of that swordfish from Donkey Kong. Like, when I think of a shark, I think of, like, Jaws and, like, a, a great white trying to bite my doodle off. Like, it's just not something I'd like to do. We're going to travel the rough seas and find ourselves another boat. Also, we've probably lost our home now. So going back to that would also be great if we could do that. If we, I don't remember what, I'll have to, if I can just make it back to that island over there, I'll know it, what, what general direction to go back to. So just, just keep an eye on that one, Lachlan, all right? Man, there's seriously nothing in the ocean right now. There's no boats, no nothing. I don't want to go diving for stuff. I hate going under the water. Oh, okay. I think we're back at home because these are the three little things, which of course I went to, uh, on a very early episode, and what is that in the water? That would be, yeah, if that's a, a shipment place, then I know where we're at, because that would be spawn. That should be a ship right there in front of us. That should be a ship. Yep, that's, uh, that's spawn. I right, actually, you know what? Let's actually go home and, uh, and drop some things off, actually. Uh, we'll, uh, get out over here. I know I'd only like to, actually, yeah, let's bring the, the bring it with us. Bring the banter barrels, because I think we're actually going to upgrade our raft as well. Because like I said, I would like to actually go ahead and chuck some more sticks on it, chop the trees down in the area. Uh, banter barrels, where do you think you go? Wait, did you get that from the sharks? These little, these little bite marks? Did the sharks do that? I hope they didn't. All right, so let's leave you there. Spin you around. Oh, he's even ready to go too. That's perfect. Yeah, why don't I just spin it outside? I should do that. Uh, how did the corrugated scraps get out here? I don't know how they did, but they did. Uh, so let's see. Let's go back to sorting the Im Okay, maybe that's how they did. <laughs> uh, let's get back to sorting the inventory. Uh, it's not looking too hot right now. Steel scraps at an all-time low. Rocks always at an all-time high. Uh, oh, let's put some more valuable loots back up here. Still yet to get the engine for our last remaining piece. Looks like all the doors do that. It's kind of annoying. Uh, so yeah, one more piece of cloth. Uh, a band-aid, actually, which is big. Um, a bandage, I should say, sorry. Uh, my crude hammer's still there. Two flares that do nothing. Where'd my banter gun go? I think it's downstairs. A whistle. For when I want to just whistle. And then uh, more compasses. Uh, there's another one, if you will. Uh, another flare that is actually on this time. So now I know where my home is. And it will scare away the predators, guys. Because it totally does that. This needs to get some uh, things in it. So I'm going to go ahead and drop that. I'll pick that up downstairs. Um, and there is... I'll keep the compass on me. And that will do for now. Let me go downstairs. Uh, there's my cooked crab that I left for last time and it somehow ate him straight away. Oh, let's actually get these two on here as well. Let's just chuck this random stick on. I know it's not- Oh, it's actually- Where'd the, uh, yeah, the oven lighter go down? There it is. There's the oven lighter. Campfire. Light that thing up. Make sure those crabs are cooking. Wait, how is one already cooked? Oh, did I eat a raw one? I think I ate a raw one. That's great. And then I need to, uh, grab my bucket, which is actually over here. Uh, I want to try and put this down- uh, yep, perfect. There we go. So hopefully that'll cook the, uh, the seawater as well. Now I'm a little scared right now because I don't know where my label maker is. Um, I thought I put him... Oh, there he is. <laughs> um, yeah, people were telling me to rename the back to the oven. So obviously... Uh, oh, I can't name it when it's cooking. I'll just name this bit here the oven because uh, obviously it is the oven and like what else do you want from me? It's the oven. Uh, that is some ding that I hear right now. I think it's the fresh water. No, it is the crabadab flab. 
Let's go ahead, eat him up. And uh, yeah, I guess let's go on a little mini mission right now to go ahead and destroy as many Oh, uh, let's put these propellers, these extra useless items down, and we have a piece of tarp as well. Uh, let's go ahead and try and collect as many trees as we can for some wood to see if we can upgrade banter barrels. And, uh, yeah, see how we go. <coughs> so it has appeared to started to rain. Now, hunting for trees isn't exactly something I'm used to. Like, I'm not used to looking for the certain resource. I gotta watch my health because, obviously, now that it is raining, it is uh, kind of dangerous to go out in uh outside because you lose temperature and you will lose health i believe so we gotta be careful about that nothing like a good old uh tree stick hunting part of the video it's weird how these sticks fall too sometimes you get two sometimes you get four sometimes you get three it's exhilarating content every time all right i think this is my last tree to take down uh there might be one oh no there's two more right here oh no this technically counts as one i think but it gives you a lot yeah, it gives you four every time. Um, but still a lot of sticks and trees to go around. We'll wait for them to grow back tomorrow. Oh, there's one more over here as well. Almost a full invent of uh, trees, which is kind of crazy. Yeah, another four. Easy work. And one more here. Definitely a good run. I think we'll be able to get one, maybe two sides added to it. Um, and then as far as the flooring goes, might mix it up and change it to what it actually... I don't like the corrugated scraps in every piece. But the steel does cost a lot, so we'll see how we go. We've got a bunch of things here. Uh, let's go ahead and go to this menu, bases, and of course, these sticks again. We can make two additional ones. Now, I want to try and support more of what's behind it. So I'm going to go here and in front of it here as well. I just want to get these four surrounding ones pretty much good to go. Make sure they're not interfering with anything that we're trying to work with. Craft again and plop that bad boy right here. Now, it can't be... Yeah, it looks like you can get... The biggest you can get is a 3x3. Three three. So, uh, just remember that. There's only two more additional spots we can work with. And then as far as flooring goes, I mean, hey, we might as well go with corrugated scraps so we can actually, like, use it for something. Uh, yeah, I would say... Uh, I love plank scraps, but I'm out of planks. And, yeah, corrugated scraps look like we're going to have to go with. So, one over here. And then, if you will, another one over on top right Excuse me? Could you... Have I got too many bases on this already, or what? What's the go, man? Maybe it's too close to another structure. I'll try and move it over a little bit. A little concerning, though. Alright, here we go. And... It's too close to another structure. Alright. Okay, so I got my boy Banter Barrels over here. Uh, I'm gonna try and see if it works on this side of it all. No, it doesn't seem to work. And the reason saying it's too close to another structure. I mean, it doesn't really make too much of a difference. I guess I'll just have to leave it like that for now. It won't let me add the last piece. It's kind of sad. Wait, what if I try a different topper? Let me try a wood stick, like... Oh, uh, no, mister, say there. Let me try this. Let me try this base. No. Nah. It's too close to another structure. Sorry, Banter Barrels, but it's not just not meant to be today, I guess. But you've been expanded, and that's all you get for now. So go back in and sit down. Um, so you got some tarp, 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 tarp. Corrugated scraps for days. Lashings right there. Rocks over here. A tarp that has flown way too far away from the original stack. And uh, I think with that, I think it's actually turning into nighttime. So, oh, there's my Banter Gun. What are you doing, man? You can't be going over there. I'll get you there, right, like, right in the middle of the sand so you don't go anywhere. Uh, can we go to sleep? No, oh, it's, not, it's not bedtime yet, apparently. Actually, I guess while we're waiting for that, let's go ahead and build that spear that everyone was talking about. Crafting a uh, spear. So it needs a rock shard. To get a rock shard, you grab a rock, and you just... I heard you could bang it up against things, and it would it would break. Like, you could, you could, you could chuck it up real high, and it would land flat. Yeah, there we go. See? Uh, two rock shards. There we go. And uh, use those rock shards for, like, the tip of the spear, I guess you say. Uh, so spear... And, uh, yeah, let's try to, oh, I guess that's to use this one anyway. Stick and spear. Let's go ahead and put this right, right, right here. Uh, you can use this to destroy things as well, but I have no use for another rock shard. Oh, I might use it later, actually. I'll chuck it down. I'll chuck it down there. Uh, oh, I didn't mean to chuck it that far. But yeah, this is my crude spear. I don't think you can actually build a better one at this stage unless I am mistaken. Uh, spear, spear, knife. I've never built a knife before. Yeah, so pretty much the only thing else I can build here. I thought you could build upgraded axes. 
Oh, I swear you could build like the, the crude axe with like the steel supplies, but now that we have this thing, we can go fishing. So this little bay area is kind of safe for fishing. Here we go. Because there's just little fishies everywhere. But you gotta you gotta click them. You gotta like dismount like that. So you gotta go like that and grab them. Like that and grab them. I actually could get a lot of fish this way. Let's do fishing for like the next five to ten minutes and see how many fishes I will collect. I don't know what fish give you better um Food. I'll have to do some research, but I know there is like ones I have to avoid like sea urchins and whatnot They, they just keep respawning so I'm kind of getting bored at this stage But we should be able to eat for a week on these things. I will probably do the rest of this off screen considering how tedious it is but Not a bad effort. I have to say oh the sun's about to go down. All right So we're about to cook an absolute metric crap ton of fish. All right, so let's go ahead and chuck these bad boys down Oh my god pilchard sardine sardine Oh boys I know I need to make sure I move these correctly in the right space. Should make sure they're directly under the fire. Uh, so welcome to Chef Ramsay with uh, Little Locky. Today we're going to teach you guys how to cook a lot of fish up at once. You're going to grab your favorite stick and make sure you don't use them. But like, welcome, why don't you use them? And that's because these are the good sticks. So you put these sticks down. You grab this stick over here, which means nothing to no one. You go down, you go down the campfire, the oven if you will. And you go, oh, where's your lighter? And then so you go find your lighter upstairs because that's where it probably is. Then you realize it's not there. So then you... So then you look around, uh, scared that you may have just lost your lighter and it's now bedtime. So you should probably get to the... Oh, and then you realize you're an idiot because it's there the whole time. All right, so then you go down to the oven. And you go set that campfire up. But... No, I need to change that campfire. No, it's, it's cooking right now anyway. But look at that. All I know is that I'm waking up to a feast and a half. The full moon is up, and that is going to be that. Alrighty, guys. Well, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and wrap today's episode of Stranded Deep up right there. Hope you guys did go on to enjoy it. If you guys did, be sure to leave a like rating down below. Hopefully, it was around 20 minutes. I know there was a lot of me and the shark. Oh, that's a ding and a half. Look at all them cooked foods. Hopefully, they don't burn. Alrighty. Everything, I believe, is cooked apart from this. Uh, no, yeah, no, everything's cooked, I think. I think there's one more fish there. Uh, this one right here. Yep, cooked sardine. Yep, they're all completely cooked actually you know what fish need to go under they will return them back to the sea you know what yeah let's return them back to the sea i'm gonna leave all my cooked food in the water and then i'm gonna eat it soggy well anyways guys i hope you enjoyed today's episode i think that was a double outro i don't really care i will see you guys hopefully tomorrow with a brand new episode later guys